They're trying to keep things moving, but it's not always possible. This bus company in the East Midlands has lost 10% of its drivers, and across the country there's a shortage of more than 4,000 bus drivers, many tempted away by big salaries on offer to drive HGVs instead. The mindset of the bus drivers at the moment is that over in the haulage industry, the employers threw money at the problem, at the shortage. So the mindset is now, we might as well do it for £20 an hour driving a lorry as £10 an hour driving a bus. A shortage of drivers means fewer buses can run. The cancellation's a problem for those with no other way to get around. I need two buses to run on time to get to work, yeah. It's quite inconvenient if my next bus gets knocked off the, the service because I go up and work at a uh, warehouse. But I feel for the older people who can't walk into town. You can't get to the hospital if you haven't got transport. It's having an impact on a daily basis at the moment. The bus companies know their customers aren't happy. We, we can't compete with the logistics and distribution sector at this moment in time. Couldn't you just pay drivers more? It's difficult to do more than we have because other cost pressures are also going up. So fuel, for example, is costing us £100,000 more so far in 2021 than it did in 2020 because the price of fuel is escalating. The Department for Transport say they're working closely with the bus sector over workforce issues. All passengers can do is wait, worry and wonder if they'll get where they need to go. Becky Johnson, Sky News, Derbyshire.